Here is your poster instructions for your Pythagorean theorem poster. Your poster needs to include the following. Who discovered the Pythagorean theorem? What is the Pythagorean theorem? This is where you want to include the equation. And a sample problem with the solution, but in this case, the problem should work out and you should get the correct answer. It should also include applications of the Pythagorean theorem, at least two of them, meaning how does the, where does the Pythagorean theorem work in real world situations, a sample problem where the equation will not work, and an explanation of why it didn't work, and any other information you'd like to put in there to help the audience understand this theorem and be able to work with it. Grading will be done on a scale of 1 to 4. 1 being limited, 2 being adequate, 3 being solid, 4 being thorough. Any of the written parts that you put into and on your poster must be in your own words. They can be typed and printed out, but they must be in your own words. These are some of the things that I'll be looking at in your poster for the grading process. Use of correct form and units. Create an attractive, readable, and appealing poster. Explain who discovered the Pythagorean theorem. Provide a sample problem and solution, one that does work and one that doesn't work. The one that doesn't work, you need to have an explanation of why it didn't work. Use of correct terminology. Identify at least two of the applications that the Pythagorean theorem is used for and communicate your thoughts effectively. What you'll need to be successful in this project is crayons, colored pencils, you can use an iPod, you can use a laptop. You can print out your material so you can have some paper where you can cut them out and you can borrow some glue sticks, a ruler, an eraser, but most of all, you need to have a plan of where you're going to put stuff, how you're going to put it, and the information that you're going to use before you actually get started with the poster. So there is some research and there is some planning to do before you actually get to the poster. I do want you to be creative with this. It will be posted and hung in the hallways. So be creative. Come up with different ways of showing but make sure it's readable and people can use it in a practical sense once you're completed with the poster and it will be hanging outside in the hallway. But have some fun with it.